Hey guys, welcome back to Let's How Do Things. And right here, you're going to notice a little bit different of a warning because this game is a little bit different than the most. It contains partial nudity. And I'm going to read it right off the box. I have it right here, and it's going to fuzz out here for a second because, you know, it's blue and all since it's PS4. But this game technically is rated M for Mature 17, FYI, just in case anybody knows. And I'm not in charge of, of whoever's watching this or or who's in charge of watching said people that are watching this. My job is to bring you content. <laughs> my, my, my job here is to bring you good video, good, good stuff. But I am, just until it, gets, until it gets too far into the video, right here on the box it says... Mature 17, rated M, blood, partial nudity, strong language, and violence. Okay? But the partial nudity, I did feel, needed a warning more specific than blood, strong language, and violence. Just an FYI. Now, to recap. We're in the desert. Recap number two. This is take two, because I didn't have my mic on. Gosh, turn it makes me upset when I do that to myself and again all I have to blame is myself but hey I, I was I wasn't very far into the video before I realized it thankfully you know this video is about an hour 40 minutes something like that long and I was maybe 10 minutes in so thank goodness I can go back and redo this I'm glad I'm not live streaming right now to sit there and have the mic off while live streaming that that would be even worse <laughs> in my opinion and I didn't realize how big this place was until I opened up the map and was like there's so much to explore which I don't know if we'll get to all of it you know there's I know there's a lot jammed into this game red dots may not be a, a good a good sign those those could mean trouble as we just sand surf right now but yeah this game come to find out if anyone watching does not already know has 26 different endings 26 which I mean there's gonna be sad ending there's gonna be happy ending there's going to be I don't know how many other variations of endings there's something else, I think it's something you have to, whenever we get to it, because I don't know how long it's going to take to get to the end here, between side quests and main story. Body report. Oh, this is where I, this is where I died in the last, last playthrough you all watched. I can bring it back? Okay, that's both cool and creepy. But now it's my helper. Well, hi. Hi to you too, as you trying to destroy me. Come back here. I didn't buy the big sword for nothing. It was the closest thing to an axe I had. Shoot everything. Let me just surf. Use the sand against you. U-Haul has been out here in the desert longer than I have. That was not nice. Back it up. Oh, thanks. Thanks for backing up. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey. 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 No ganging up. That's not cool. From one android to a robot. Just, just hang in there. Just chill. Jeez. Easy. Easy. Whoa. You're done. Hey, you're trying to sneak up. Have some of that fat sword. Yeah, that's what I thought. Oh, Android's still with us. I did not realize. Can I heal the Android? I, I That's something I didn't really think about in-game. Oops. And can you have more than one? That's, that's now another question. Like, if I die multiple times... And I mean, honestly, you know, each android is just a shell. This is bringing back the, the ghost in the shell references now. Where you just upload your personality or upload yourself. 
which I always thought was an interesting concept, but I don't think I could go through with it. Plus, that would get confusing after a while. Plus, it brings the question, what if, what if the electrical grid goes down and everyone's electronic, or partially electronic? Did, wouldn't that cause issue? So many things to think about, so many possibilities, so many fan fictions I'm sure that are out there about it. Come here, you. Yep. Thank you, old self. I don't know if they're coming with us or not. Whee! Everyone enjoys surfing. Whee! I'd enjoy surfing if I could do it. I can't even skimboard. I used to try and skimboard in Daytona Beach, where I used to live in Orlando, Florida, and we used to go there when I was younger, off and on, because it was only like an hour or two away. And I didn't mean to do that. I did not mean to use my laser cannon. And I sat there, prepared spot of skimboard, couldn't do it. Alright, so we gotta take out all the Wi-Fi blockers. Gotcha. You did not see what was coming, did you? You're you're just like I'm I'm hanging in the sand, building sandcastles, and then whap sword. They weren't doing anything. They weren't harming nobody, and all of a sudden I had to come up and just smack them. I don't know if it's because we're we're in a desert, or it's just I I'm I'm talking too quick today. But I need a drink. I'm sorry. I need to. Sorry. Can't talk with a dry mouth. And what are the red dots? I don't know if that's good. I don't know if that's bad. There's a vending machine out in the middle of nowhere, but then again, it's... Whoever cleverly thought to put save points in vending machines in this, I, I, I applaud you, because I never would have thought that personally. I, I like to try and think outside the box with concepts, but that's something I, I personally wouldn't have thought of. And maybe that's something in other games that Square has made before, but I, I'm not... I don't know. Again, this this reminds me kind of like Final Fantasy kind of stuff, and if it's from the same creators or one of the same creators or people that was on the team in order to make that, I'm not aware. There's... a you know, as soon as I think I, I know a good chunk of video game stuff, there, there's something else that comes along and I know absolutely nothing. <laughs> it's just the way it works. But what are you going to do, right? Whee! Kind of reminds me of, like, Tony Hawk. Even though I know Tony Hawk doesn't surf, or does he? I just know what he's known for in skateboarding. I'm so old I still remember uh, Tony Hawk's Underground on Nintendo 64. That's that's what I that's what I'm aware of. I don't know any like famous surfers off the top of my head. Okay. We're going to the waterfall. Well, not waterfall technically. I guess it's a sandfall. Is is what it would be, wouldn't it? I mean, come on, guy, I'll get with the program. Get whatever that was out of my eyes. Sheesh. You're not that scary. You're trying to be, and I give you points for trying wherever you just disappeared to. It's heading for that rocky area. Individual target ID marked. Get back here. Get back here and fight like a real robot. And I was like, this is nice. This is nice. Again, I, I just, I have to appreciate how much went into just even your surroundings. I, I know it seems like it's plain and simple and dull, but if you look back at graphics the way they used to be on, like, the PlayStation, and yeah, there, there's a sweet spot for, the you know, the retro gaming, what's now retro gaming, my childhood... Desert housing. Housing. 
can't speak today. What's that? Analysis. It is the ruin of a former human residential area. Yeah. Large numbers of humans resided in such concrete and metal shelters. The structures were referred to by names such as apartment complex. Yep. Yeah. You're not wrong. Report. Mail notification received from access point. You've got mail. That brings back flashbacks. Of dial-up internet. Anyone remember those days? That pipe kind of looks like a cannon. And I'm not for sure if it was sewage or if that was the only fresh water source. I mean, you gotta get water out here somehow. And I mean, if these buildings... I forget what year we're in. Get, just, just look back on one of my old videos that says it, I think, in the very first one or even the second one. But it says, like, it's whatever year after the aliens threw out all the androids and caused problems where there was a lot less humans on the planet. But come on, these engineers that built these buildings, they're still here after all that time. Like, congrats to them. Oh, you were hiding behind the vending machine. You trying to be sneaky? Trying to be sneaky, weren't you? More map information. I I will spam save if I have to. Let's check our mail. Let's see what this says. Operator sixty to two B. Have you heard of the Jupiter for Jupiter fortune telling? It's all the girls over in R&D have been talking about lately. They say you can examine the color and shape of Jupiter's great red spot to learn about what kind of luck you will have with health, work, and love. Sounds amazing, right? I'll try it and let you know what I find out. Okay. Uh, Council of Humanity. Thousands of years have passed since we humans were driven to the moon, and while the war remains... Yeah, I think that's... Isn't that the message that we heard over the radio? Something I forgot to mention prior to your... According to our analysis... Ah, I'll read it later. I think that was the note about the factory. I'll have to... I'll, I'll go back in in the next playthrough and I'll, I'll read it real quick. In case any were curious. Unless you already went back by now and I'm just rambling while you've got the video paused and you're reading it for yourself. Oh, you've got buzz saws on the front of you. You mean business. Back it up there. Nope. Nope. That's, you're you're kind of like a turtle. You, you couldn't get up once you were on your back. <laughs> Look at 2B carry that big sword. It's like, I got, I got this. I got the big sword for you. Come at me. Yep. Target confirmed. Let's get him. Run, run, run. Oh, oh, you brought friends. Sure. Absolutely ice weather to not be slain by you all. I'm on a mission, guys. Sorry. I've I've got I've got robots to find, people to slash with my big old sword and my big katana there. You can't even see the other sword because of how massive that one is. Scary. Scary. See, I can't tell if they're just repeating things. Or and see, this is where I look back in the game. If I hadn't have done this, would they have left me alone? Ooh, charge up! I didn't realize that was a thing. That's an awfully bigger hit, and that was a very big hit as well. I'm sure I ruined one of my good endings. I ruined one of my more wholesome, compassionate endings because I decided to take them out. See, they mad now. They are very mad, and I don't blame them. 
And I mean, technically, I'm an android robot as well. I mean, I am a higher, I guess, model, you could say, that, you know, can think for themselves. You brought the big brother with. Oh my. Oh my. Easy there. What to do with you? You're, you're like reminiscent of Iron Giant. Not even joking. I'm sure I'm not the only one who thought this. Well, that didn't do diddly to you. <laughs> Falco Punch! <laughs> That's what that reminds me of. No. No. I'm going in for the big hit. You must have been like a rock crusher or something like that. Like, sheesh. Like, I, I don't know what... I don't know what you would have been used for. Oh. 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 Nope. 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 No. Oh, double tap. I'm down. A carefree android saw a machine in love. Well, apparently in game I skipped too quick. Love with humans at the horns of I think that said war. I'm not for sure. Now I skipped most of this to go back and try again. Hoping that maybe, just maybe this time, I could do better. And see this is where I realized that there were actual hot button keys for me to use health. Isn't that amazing? But I actually figured out how to do that. And it seems like every time I play, I have to re-figure it out. Oh. Give me the part. I want the part. I guess I'm not supposed to have it. That's just not something that's supposed to happen. Anyway, back on track to find this robot. these words? Nine, I've been wondering the same thing. I've been wondering the same exact thing. This looks welcoming. Hypothesis. They were killed by local machine life forms. What are they doing here? Unknown. It's like they were gathered here. Yeah. A little creepy. Kind of mannequin-like. I can deal with mannequins for the most part, but still, even though these are androids, even though they're not humans, it's still disturbing. Oh, go go in the giant hole, you say. Is this a cave of wonders? There it goes. Ah. I'm coming for you, man. I'm a-coming for you. Oh boy, big red dot. This place got slammed. But what's with these android bodies? Stay focused. I'm sorry, that's all, all I did, literally all you missed was after that cutscene I dropped down and started doing this. There was like a small jump in between recording there. So I'm sorry. Oh, Nelly. I'm definitely going to lose health. Oh, okay, not as much as I thought I was. Child. Um. Child. Child. What is this? Well, most refer to it as a brothel. <laughs> They're speaking of love. Like, actual, genuine... Together forever love, and I guess I'm gonna have to break up the party. They don't have any feelings. They're just imitating human speech. Let's take them out. Technically, you as an android, aren't you just imitating human speech as well? I don't know how this works. I don't know where the line is drawn between robots and androids. I don't know. But these robots are just wanting to procreate and make life. 
I guess to further their existence. Ooh. Ooh, slam me to the sand. Sheesh. Well, that that did amazing, amazing ballet in, in the air skills there, 2B. But we're going to have to practice that later. Nope, 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 nope. Y'all are ganging up again. You're all good at that ganging up stuff. I tell you. Nope. Ooh, yay, level up. When did I get to level 8? I've not been paying attention. Last time I checked, I was like level 3 or 4. Oh. I would think that hit would be so much. This cannot continue, eh? There's more of you. There's a lot more of you. Back it up, back it up. Oh. Alright, they said I could self-destruct in... when it gets bad. They said I can do that, so... I'm gonna have to here in a minute, and it's just gonna blow them all up, right? Oh. Oh. Okay. You just thought, oh, thought you're all gonna malfunction or blow up or something. Are you making a big robot, or are you doing like the the get together and make make a giant robot thing here? What the, what's happening? I, I'm trying to figure it out too, man. Is it a hive? Ew. <laughs> An android? What? <laughs> this is a machine. What? <laughs> it birthed a candle. <laughs> We just saw the birth of a Ken doll, folks. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> How do I attack you? Well, that would have worked if I would have hit you. Again, good question. Why are androids fighting robots? I would think that if that if humans created these androids and sent them back to Earth to try and fight for them and to fight against robots, the robots and androids would get together and say, Hey, you're this. Hey, you're this. We're about the same. Let's go ahead and take over humans. You would think, unless there's like a calculated failsafe in the androids, that's where I died. So this this next part here is where I'm gonna try again. But yeah, it's like I, I there there has to be something that's that's calculated, kind of like an iRobot with the I think it's the three laws uh, of robots or the three rules, something like that. If memory serves me correct, which it normally doesn't, but. Let's try this again. It's like, okay, I know, I know, birth and everything else. I, I get it. Ooh, supercharge! What? Maybe it's just because you, you're you're a, a big baddie. I, I'm not for sure. So for, for a big... Or for a new android, you've got a lot of health. You're trying. Which I want to still know how that works. Nope, 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 nope. Sword. Dodge. Yep. Deflect. You're learning real quick there. He's getting out of noob, mo noob mode. He's figuring it out. 
Oh. Ow. He's going like Super Saiyan with teleporting. Oh, look at that. I'm gonna chop your head there. Look at that. Just keep firing at him. I should have locked on. I finally figured out how to do that, and now I regret not doing it in this play. Don't teleport. You were doing fine on the ground. Now you gotta. Now you gotta go into sniper mode or, or turret mode. You just playing games now. You are just playing games. Oh, big hit. Give me some of that health, thank you. Oh, where'd you go? Where? where, where? Oh, there. Yeah, see, lock-on would have helped a lot. I realize I'm making the game way harder on myself. I just realized if you really listen to the music in between the fighting, you can still hear the robot saying this could not continue. Like to the beat. Kinda of creepy. Come on, we're so close. We got this. We got this. We can get him. Whoa, whoa, whoa. No giant lines of light for me. No thank you. No. No. You're already level nine. You're you're above me now. Whoa. Easy. Easy there. At least I'm able to miss that relatively well. I can't miss that one. Dude has hit me every time with that one. Come on. Oh, we're that we're we're right there. Right there. Come on. Smack. Oh, he smacked me. Ooh. Interrupted my attack. Oh. There we go. Go in for the sword. And still got knocked back nonetheless. Oh, look. I leveled up. Dang, guys. No chill. No chill at all with you two. <laughs> so is that blood? Is that just android is juice? Really a machine? But I, I'm... I don't know. Damn it, not another one. No wonder you had an upset stomach. <laughs> Bring it down the house. So there's actual twins, and you ate your other twin? And they just made an escape hole for the twin? I'm I'm confused. I have so many questions and no answers, but right now I need to get out of here before I can't answer them. I need to scram like a lamb running from a lion. And I don't even know, I just made that up, but we need to get out of here pronto. Back out of the cave. I don't even know if it's the same cave. I don't think it is. Stopped. Looks like we're safe now. Nope, it's not the same cave. What the hell just happened? I know. Ah. I've never seen a machine like that before. Neither have I. This to command. Yeah, see if you can figure out a weakness or why it is the way it is. How do all those little solid robots get together? Make a um. Well, yeah, we'll we'll Let's leave it at that. With better reception, so we can contact command. <laughs> I need signal. I need a signal somewhere. Can we find one? But how did that many robots get together, make that, and then 
birth out an android. How does that how does that work? Droid, you doing okay? You're kind of up in the rocks over there. They don't even see us. Oh, this is just this is cheating at this point. This is cheating. No. <laughs> hey, how you guys doing? I'm I'm doing good. How's the weather? <laughs> All right. <laughs> oh, maybe maybe I should have continued the route I was going. Sheesh. Back it up. Alright, so I guess now I have to wander through this maze, wherever it leads me. I keep hitting the laser cannon button. I don't know why. I think, I, I think I'm think i goofing up dash and goofing up the laser cannon. And I'm sure there's a way to switch them, but I feel like... We should be able to reach command here. I feel like as soon as I switch them, that's when I'm going to goof it up worse. I read you, 9 There's some weird crap going on. Humanoid machines. We weren't able to capture them, but I have combat data ready for upload. Understood. Ready to receive. Hopefully, you can get something out of it. So, do your eyes like record everything you do? And so, as soon as you get within signal area, you can just upload it. No different than. I guess, like, you know, a video to YouTube or something like that. It's like, hey, check this video out that I found. I lived this. <laughs> There's a Ghost in the Shell style mod. Vlogging, vlogging would be so different. It would be in first person. It would be like you were living that life. And if that's, if that's already been thought of, then look out world. Because, <laughs> oh my goodness. You had Google Glasses? Forget Google Glasses. You are, you are the camera. <laughs> these guys are stacked like checkers. That's, I, I see these, and they remind me, one, of checkers, and two, they also remind me of the, the little spike cactus or cactus, not cactus. Cactus enemy. I'm standing on your head. In uh, Mario, where there'd be like so many stacked up and you would throw something at them, like throw a shell at them and they'd get knocked down and they'd just <laughs> drop until they were nothing. <laughs> Sometimes I don't even know what I'm shooting at, but again, I need to learn how to lock on properly. I mean, you all saw the first video I did with all the controls. You know, we, we had the, the controller sitting in the middle of the screen, and around it was, I don't know, probably 30 different button controls. <laughs> I don't want to switch configurations and then be more confused. <laughs> That's what I would do. Let's see if we can find any more up here. How do we get up here? Oh, hey, you guys are just kind of hanging out. Ooh, you a big and well, well, see, I thought I thought you were big. I, ow. At one point I thought you were, like, pretty big enemy. And then and then I met uh, Mr. Uh, Buzzsaw Crane Monster uh, Android Robot um, you know, Kill 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 guy, you know, remember that one? Mm -hmm. Yeah, met, met him. And then I met Iron Giant not too long ago here in this playthrough, and, um, yeah. You guys aren't so big no more. First first play, yeah, you were a problem. Not no more. And I will gladly take any of you all without weapons over robots with capes and weapons. Because you all can do a little bit less damage. I guess the moral of the story is it could always get worse. And be happy with your current situation. <laughs> don't don't take it for granted. Because <laughs> when you do, that's when problems happen. See me getting lost again. Where am I supposed to go? I don't know. Um, 
Okay. So that's the desert. That's where I'm at. And the red up above me is, I guess, where I'm supposed to go. And there's a body there. I don't know if I can go through there or there. I think that's where you can go. I don't know. I'm not. I'm not really for sure. Yeah, current destination. Got it. I think I got it. And I'm gonna have to remember too. It looked like if I pause, I can save right there. Which, you know, while while I'm playing, didn't pay attention to that. No siree. They were just kind of hiding out. Again, I don't know if it's the desert level or what, but I, I am more thirsty in this playthrough. Sorry about that. See, I didn't have to get to the access point to save, but oh well. Me being me, I saved two or three times in a row. No new messages. Oh hey, it's Jack! I hear you kicked some tin can ass out in the desert. So I guess, you know, thanks or whatever. You're welcome and whatever. Don't go trying to be a hero, alright? I'll try not to. Hey, welcome back. Thanks hey, for again. securing access to those desert resources. It's a huge help. I know I it isn't much, but please take this. It's the least I can do. Oh, and be sure to swing by if you ever need anything, alright? Sure. What can I help you with? <laughs> I'm back. <laughs> Ooh, more stuffs. More stuffs to buy. I probably need a bunch of these. I'll just, I'll, I'll take a bunch since I, I find so much gold out and about. Now, why did you go from talking to text talking? That's confusing. That's very confusing. Current destination... Okay, so there's the body there, which it looks like there's a pass-through right there, but that's going to have to be for the next video if I can get, get to it, okay? So all you peeps, folks, and dudes, stay awesome. Hope you have a wonderful day. Hope you enjoyed this video. Please like, share, subscribe, love it, hate it, shame it, whichever you feel. And I'll say what I normally say and say, bye, and see ya!